One of the things that happens when you listen more fully, listen more clearly, one of the things when you, that happens when you detect more data is you find uh, that it's not all connected. It's not true that everything is connected to everything else. It is true that everything is connected to something else, but the connections are a lot more sparse than we generally think. So when you start to detect all of these different signals about a patient's care over the lifetime of their condition, uh, don't think of it so much as a uh, painting you know, that gets you know, painted line by line and is fully complete, but rather think of it as more of a web, as more of um, a set of sparse connections. Think of it like the transportation network of the world. So if you picture the airports of the world with all of these tens of thousands of flights crisscrossing every day, it, it, it looks like this set of connections. But not every flight is connected to every other one. And it's the same thing that happens when you gather more data together of greater variety and detect more of the world. It doesn't create a perfect, complete picture. It creates many, many, many more interconnections. The challenge then uh, is how to interpret uh, those connections. The challenge then is how to arrange and rearrange uh, those connections um, to recompose uh, this great diversity of data with all of its interconnectedness in various different ways into a new perspective that then helps you understand the larger picture a little more fully.